a BBC News presenter was interrupted during their live coverage outside the High Court today by 90s singer Brian Harvey. The East 17 band member was spotted as Prince Harry returned to court to give evidence in his individual case against him GN over alleged unlawful information gathering. BBC News correspondent Joe Inwood had been reporting outside the Rolls building when a person could be heard shouting during the live coverage. Taking to Twitter afterwards, the BBC reporter shared a photo of Harvey, 48, in a grey tracksuit, shades and a backwards-facing baseball cap. He wrote, So, turns out the protester who disrupted our live broadcast, was Brian Harvey from Me 17 No wonder I lost my train of thought. Harvey was filmed yelling up at the building this morning that he could help the Duke of Sussex but that he needed to leave, his barrister, David Sherborne behind. Some 33 articles, dated between 1996 and 2009, have been selected for examination by Prince Harry during the trial. The stories cover the Duke's relationship with his family and ex-girlfriend Chelsea Davy, a few injuries and illnesses, his military service and allegations of drug use. MGN has told the trial that it denies that 28 out of the 33 articles involved unlawful information gathering and that it was not admitted for the remaining five articles. The Duke is suing MGN for damages, claiming unlawful information gathering took place at its titles The Daily Mirror, Sunday Mirror and The Sunday People. He alleges that about 140 articles published between 1996 and 2010 contained information gathered using unlawful methods, and 33 of these have been selected to be considered at the trial. Harry's claim is being heard alongside three other representative claims during a trial which began last month and is due to last six to seven weeks. MGN is contesting the claims and has either denied or not admitted each of them. The publisher also argues that some of the claimants have brought their legal action too late. An MGN spokesperson said, where historical wrongdoing has taken place, we have made admissions, take full responsibility and apologize unreservedly, but we will vigorously defend against allegations of wrongdoing where our journalists acted lawfully. MGN is now part of a very different company. We are committed to acting with integrity and our objective in this trial is to allow both the business and our journalists to move forward from events that took place many years ago.